Good morning, good evening, and welcome to War Thunder. Today, we'll be driving and reviewing the new Rank 5 Battle Rating 7.3 Chinese Event Vehicle, the PLC 83-130. So, the PLC 83-130, is it good? Well, in the right situations, it can be devastating, but oftentimes not, it's not very good at all. But when you find yourself in that very good position, it's a very fun vehicle to play. But with that out of the way, let's take the PLC 83-130 into battle. And here we are on the map Japan Domination. Take a look at the scoreboard, we see that it is a full game. Our allies for this match will be the Americans, the British and the Soviets. We will take our tank to a hill overlooking both caps 1A and B. Our goal in this position is to punish any enemies that try to get their way onto capture 1A and B. And after not waiting too long, we do catch our first prey, that being a German M41 Walker Bulldog. But we are taking fire from the enemy hill and enemy positions running capture with Bravo. So we'll try to maneuver our tanker to return fire as quickly as possible. And that positioning results in an enemy target to HP removed from the game. With the enemy threat at Bravo Point being dealt with, we now turn our attention to the opposing hill where an enemy JPC 45 is holding out. With the enemy JPC 45 now cresting the hill, we take the chance to peek up and eliminate them too. Turning our attention back to Bravo Point, we see that an enemy band cannon is advancing, so we creep up once again and eliminate him. And our next threat is to our left, we creep up and eliminate the German Tiger 2 in the process saving our friendly tank. With the coast now clear we decide to move up and advance to the next hill. Now at the next hill, we narrowly avoid death with the enemy Tiger 2P staring at us, but we're quicker and we aim at his third cheek which knocks him out. Hearing engine noises to our front once again, we decide to lay an ambush. That ambush now pays off with the enemy German Tiger 2H pulling up right in front of us, which we quickly take care of. Hearing engine noises to our left now, we decide to crest the hill and we find a enemy Jag Tiger, which we also take care of with a shot from the side. area now being dealt with, we once again decide to move up to the next hill to lay an ambush. With that ambush quickly paying off when an enemy Ostwin 2 wanders into our sights. With the Ostwin 2 miraculously surviving a direct hit from a 130mm cannon, we decide to move up and finish him off with a burst of our heavy MG. But our friendly takes care of it, and we decide once again to move up.
Now moving up, we lay our eyes on the enemy spawn. In that enemy spawn, there is a enemy Yak Tiger and a Tiger Troop. So we decide to hide and wait in ambush until the perfect chance arises to move forward and take care of one of them. And that chance quickly arriving when both of them turn their attention to other teammates, we decide to move forward and eliminate the Tiger Troop. Continuing to move across, we move into the other side where a enemy M48 is waiting. We quickly take care of him too with a shot to the cannon barrel and a follow up shot to the lower glazes bit the game. Continuing to advance, we are getting shot by a enemy 20mm cannon. We decide to move up against it since it is the end of the game. We get one shot into him, but the game ends and we don't get killed. With that being said, this video is coming to an end. Thank you for sticking all the way through. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and subscribe. And as always, there will be more content to come about War Thunder. Take care. I'm out.